Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Don, and in this video we're looking at what may have very well been the play of the game that helped us beat the Chicago Bears. And that's when our edge rusher, Jalen Phillips, blocked that punt, and Andrew Van Ginkle then ran it in for a touchdown. Guys, when we got Bradley Chubb from the Denver Broncos, one of the things that's going to happen, and I believe already has, is the offensive line now cannot pay as much attention to Jalen Phillips because they have to be very concerned about Bradley Chubb on the other side. And I think that's what happened here. And, and I also think that I talked about this earlier when we first got Bradley Chubb, that he was going to stir up some of the other players like Jalen Phillips. And I believe that's what happened, because if you look at that play, Jalen Phillips just overwhelmed uh, the guy trying to block him, and he actually blocked that punt with his chest. That's how much he beat him by. Usually when they block a punt, their, their arms are extended and they block it with their hands. He had beaten his, his blocker so badly that if you look at the play, he blocked the, the punt with his chest. He could have almost tackled the, the punter. And, and guys, um, I'm going to be really focusing on, on Jalen Phillips now because a couple of years ago when, when we drafted him in the first round, I believe a lot of the analysts had Jalen um, uh, uh, pegged as, as the number one edge rusher in the college draft, okay? And... I think he's being double teamed a lot. At, at times, even triple teamed. They're very concerned about this guy. Jalen Phillips, 6'5", 6'6", uh, he's close to 270 pounds. He's, he's fast, he's powerful, he's still very young, guys, and, and he may be ready for a breakout year. And um, this is going to be real exciting. Because, look, our, our offense lit it up, but we got that touchdown on, on special teams, and, and we needed it. We won, we won by three points. That touchdown may have put us uh, over the edge, over the top, and, and now we're six and three. Uh, the defense, yes, we know they have a lot of work to do, but, but uh, that's something we could build on. And, and let me tell you something, guys. Uh, Bradley uh, Chubb, th this was his first game. Uh, he just missed a couple of sacks. He, he hurried the quarterback. He pressured the quarterback. And he, he's now been thrown in to the lion's den, so to speak, okay? He's in there now. Uh, and uh, he's going to get a full week of practice in with the Dolphins now. And, and we're going to see Bradley Chubb and, and Jalen Phillips. These guys, these guys are going to be like a pair of German shepherds on the end of the line. Okay, uh, I really think they're going to be disrupting things. And, and you're going to see a turnaround with our defense. I, I, I really believe that. Um, and one, one of uh, the viewers of, of my videos has pointed out, too, we, we've got Dolphins that, that have been injured. They're going to be coming back. Uh, we've got Channing Tindall is, is, is going to start getting some playing time. Eventually, he's going to get the opportunity to contribute. And, and guys, um, I believe things are going to come together soon. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you click on the like icon and send me your comments. I want to hear from you guys. Subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time.